here. Hits another three. Oh. 43. Bill this year. I think that would surprise a lot of people. 45. Final minute 30. Bryant from 14. Has 50. Round. Bryant for three. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Truth, Kicknology. Y'all know the sayings. There is knowledge in your walk, know what you're wearing. And it's showing up Saturday. And man, I showed been waiting on this package. As y'all can tell by the Kobe jersey, y'all know Kobe my dude. I've been waiting on this package since April 13th. And man, it took a while for them to make these shoes. Um, so let me go ahead and let me get out my knife, man. Don't don't be scared. You know, I know you sneakerheads got the nice knives. I got this straight from my kitchen, man. I'm going to try not to cut myself, too. Look at that. Bam. All right, so, man, like I said, before I, before I open up this box, before I even take it out of the box, I, I'm opening up this shoe for the first time with you guys. Like I said, I just got it in. I, I just want to make sure I got it on camera because, um... I know everybody had a chance to ID their own shoes, so these are the Mamba Day uh, Kobe's, and um, they dropped on April 13, 2016. It was the, it was the night he played his final game, and you had an opportunity, like as soon as the game um, started, you had an opportunity to go and ID your shoe. So I went on there, I ID'd my shoe, my wife put her input on it and stuff like that, and I just been looking for a Kobe shoe that's all black that I can rock with all the jerseys because you know the yellow and gold is kind of tough so let's get right into it uh, black and silver box I don't know I wish they would have made it an actual you know nice packaging you know what I'm saying but they didn't so it is what it is man I'm super excited let's see what comes in here we got the we got this little um piece of paper here it says as the stats mounted so did the love and in the hate Love the truth because the numbers don't lie. And then it says 11, 1, 96, the story began. Uh, 24 on his back, 20 years in one city, 81 points in the game, 5 championships in rings, 18 star appearances, 4 all-star MVP honors, and then 4, 13, 16, which was Mama Day. So you know what I'm saying? That's what, it, that's what it is. Hope you guys can actually see that a little bit. If you can't, then I'll put some steals up. But this is basically all the stats on the shoes. Now. Let's open up the shoe. That night that Kobe um, scored that 60 points, you know, he had 60 points, uh, four rebounds, four assists, one steal, one block. It took him 50 shots to do it, but like I said, I always tell everybody, Kobe came into the league shooting, so I was happy to see him go out shooting. And uh, he became the, the fourth player to have 60 points, multiple 60 point games right after Wilt Chamberlain. You know, Wilt Chamberlain had 32, Kobe had five, uh, six, Michael Jordan had five, and then Elgin Baylor had four. So he won up on Jordan. Maybe he didn't get more rings, but at least he scored more 60 point games. Dude, here they go. I mean, I love this shoe already. It's, it's, it's exactly what I wanted. I wanted the, the translucent blue bottom on them right out of the gate. That was a big deal for me. I ha you had three options. You had to the option to put the full lunar technology in it or the half or the precision. I went with the half because the full lunar. These shoes, they were, I think they were 240, if I'm not mistaken, total. But um, with the full lunar, man, they jumped up to like 400 bucks. So, I mean, my pockets ain't that deep. So I just went ahead and went with the um, half lunar. So at least it's still good. Um, but. I know you're looking at them thinking that they look just like the ones that was on television, which they really are similar, but the difference in mine is, is that I changed the tongue on them. As you can see here, it's not black, it's, it's uh, actually a, a gold material. And man, I just wanted to put more gold on it, man. It just was a nice touch on it to me. Like I said, all of the, the stats on there, I've seen some IDs online with the um, all white, with the black writing or the purple um, writing on it and stuff like that. But like I said, I just wanted a black shoe that I can rock multiple uh, with multiple Kobe jerseys. I got the blackout jersey on now, but I mean, you guys let me know what you think, man. I, I really think I did a nice job IDing these things. Look out, uh, look out, um, Nike. Maybe I, maybe I need to get me a contract with them. Maybe, maybe not. But uh, like I said, man, look at the laces. I'm, I'm hoping you guys can actually see this. The laces are with the gold uh, tips on them and then they have the gold speckle right there in between all the laces. 
kind of like a confetti type. So on the back of them, I decided to go with the gold Black Mama logo. You had different options you could have picked from um, on there. You could have went with the number 24. You could have went. With, they had some type of snake on there. They had a bunch of options, but. I, I tried to keep it gangster, you know what I'm saying, with the black Mamba logo. And then on the back of this one, I kept the Achilles marks. I made them in gold. Just to, just because I felt like this was the rise and fall of Kobe's career, so I had to keep that on there. Black Mamba, Mamba Day 13s. Very dope shoe. Very clean. Nice shoe. I can rock with all my Kobe jerseys. Let me know below if you guys were able to cop some. Also, let me know if you think I did a good job on this ID thing. I mean, maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I know it's a lot of different ones out there, and, and I think that's just, I think it's a dope concept that um, Nike gives you to be able to ID your shoes. Man, I appreciate you guys tuning in. M make sure you hit that thumbs up button, like, subscribe, comment, share this video. Um, follow us on Kicknology.com, Kicknology on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, everything social media, Kicknology. It's your boy True. Know what you wear, there's knowledge in your walk. I appreciate you guys tuning in. I'm out. Say a little prayer, you don't wanna be so vain, but if I get them in my hands, I'll give them the best care. Introducing a fresh new brand, following the dreams. Faith, hard work, and dedication is the means. If they fresh out the box, then you gotta keep them clean. There's that knowledge in your walk when you step on the scene. Technology, ain't no apology. Don't make it hard, man. It ain't trigonometry. You gotta be smart when you shop. Are you looking for authentic? If you are, then stop. Cause you probably will regret it We say no synthetic No synthetic If they ready We'll let you know If you should go and get them We got fat We got two Never slack On the roof For OG's and the U You can kick it with us too Technology